and today we are drinking vanilla coke and hopefully as I get into this I will be able to lower the sound a bit on my end and hopefully that means that everything is perfect for y'all so the game music won't play so loudly over my voice we shall see though I think what's happening is um, is the OBS is picking up the sound not only from the computer where it's supposed to pick it up, but it's picking it up through my microphone and headphones because my headphones are attached to my microphone and my microphone is attached to the computer. And it's playing all the sound for me. So I'm crossing my fingers and hoping this works. If it still is too loud after this episode, then I will uh, call in other people who know more. Um, settings. I did turn the sound down, didn't I? Okay. So that's better on my end. Let's make sure real quick. Uh, <clears throat> well, I don't wanna, it's gonna make me, so we'll just play and then I'll check after like I have been doing the other videos. I don't need the weather cause I don't have enough of the thingies. Today is going to be a neutral day and uh, fences are useful for keeping weeds at bay, protecting your crops. They also let farmers contain their livestock. Fences break down after a while, but stone, iron, and hardwood fences last a lot longer than basic wood. Awesome. Ooh. Oh, Clint, you have an amazing hat. Uh, hi there. Good morning. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. If you want to get the most out of the ores you find, you'll need a furnace. Just so happens I had an extra set of blue pens lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Thank you. I'm going to make a furnace. Learned how to craft a furnace. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. Awesome. When you smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. All right. I also got mail. Robin here. I know there's a lot of stones scattered around your farm. If you have a surplus, you might consider having me build a well for you. Wells can be placed all over your farm and serve as convenient places to refill your watering can. Just swing by my shop with 75 stones and a hundred or a thousand G when you're ready for it, Robin. Okay. Oh, another one. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventurer's spirit. That much I can tell. If you can slay 10 slimes, you've earned your place in my adventurer's guild. Be careful, Merlin. All right. So we have 10 slimes, zero out of 10. Uh, if you're going to keep mining, you should build a furnace, craft a furnace. Oops. And then uh, get to level 40. Hi, kitty. Oops. And then let's get you some water. Um... Okay. <clears throat> oh, here's my potato. Uh, uh, what was supposed to go there? I forgot to get a bean. Okay. I know that that's kale. So let's go ahead and go like this. And then we'll go ahead and put the kale seed there. And then I also want to hoe this so I can put potatoes um, I think that this is a hemp yes okay but 
else do we need? Oh, I need to water everything. Uh, so, oops. What are these? Chamomile. Are these parsnips? I already forget what I planted the last time. I need bean, one bean, and then I'm going to need some turnips because I need five golden turnips for the, um, for the Junimos. We can bring Junimo stuff today. I forget if I made plans. Oh, this is done already? Okay. And this is done. Some of these are new plants that I've never used before, so I don't know much about them and what I should keep and what I should get rid of, like just sell. I guess for now I can just sell everything because we, um, oops, I gotta go get more water because we can grow more in the next seasons after we build our kitchen, which I think the kitchen is our first upgrade on the house, but it's going to take me a little bit to get there. I'm in no rush in this game. I'm not trying to like have a bunch of goals that I'm going to meet. Oops, I forgot to water that one. It looks like uh, one of the things I do want to get done though is to build the coop because now that's one of our um, goals on the over here journal. And then today is a neutral day, so maybe we can go to the mines and see if we can get some more copper, because if we get more copper, then we just need 2,000 more coins to fill up, uh, or to make a copper tool. That wasn't so bad. Okay, now what do we want to do today? Um, I haven't actually finished exploring my farm. We also still haven't met everyone around town. Okay, so... Oh, so cute. Little Chipley characters. Oops, this one. Oh, I did the wrong button. No, I keep doing the wrong button. This one. We'll get there eventually. Ooh, what's all this? Okay, so I can't go in there until I upgrade my axe. But... Uh, we can at least clear it out up until there. I keep hitting the wrong button. Okay, I want this one. Oh, cool. It actually reached through the little staff there. No, nope, wrong button. Please bear with me as I get through this. Maybe it'll just be easier if I click everything and then keep my fingers on the... All the, um... ones where I move. Oops. I say that as I keep using my fingers to determine which of these we're gonna mess with. It'll, it's just gonna be one of those days. Oops. 
So I don't know how most other people do this, but I keep wanting to use my uh, pointer finger to determine or to move when it's my middle finger that's on the button. Um, there we go. I was like, why is it not? Oh, and then I keep using my middle finger to try to go up when it's my ring finger. And then we have a piece of wood here. <clears throat> oh, it's 3 p.m. already. I guess let's go, oops. Uh, let's go sell some stuff to Pierre and buy some stuff real quick. And then we'll come back and clean up the farm some more. Uh, 120 reward. You get to keep the fish. Sardine. Ooh, I could go fishing. Fishing's not my favorite. Vincent's birthday is coming up. Maybe I just won't focus on birthdays this year because there's a lot of people and I don't quite know what all they like. I guess I'll say hi to you. The trees look nice today, don't they? You look nice today, Leah. So why did you become a farmer? I want to make tons of money. It's more real than living in the city to follow in grandpa's footsteps. I wanted to escape my old life. Hmm. Which one should I choose? I think I'm going to go with, uh, this one. That's pretty much the reason I came here too. Cool. I wish Abby wouldn't spend so much time in her room. Yeah, but at the same time, it's like her safe space, I guess. Okay, now let's sell these. Potato, kale, basil. I'm gonna keep this one until I have some better ones to um, show on my Grange. And then, what else did I say? I need one bean. Uh, I like planting potatoes for some reason. I don't think I'm ready to plant a tree yet. I wanna pick one of the areas um, the fenced off areas to put my trees in. There's a bug net. Catches critters and stuff. I want to learn more about that. And then I'll plant some more of these. I'll come say hi to you. Welcome. If you're looking for seeds, you've come to the right place. Okay. Ooh, hi, Abby. Oh, hey, taking a break from work? Yes, a short one. I'm gonna come interrupt you. Oops. Ah, my head. Come on, click. Hi. Hi. Oops, Sam. Maybe I should move out of your way so I can click on you. Hey, farmer. You are so adorable with your little earrings, piercings. Oh my goodness. So I slept kind of funny last night and I have this kink right in the, uh, to the right of my spine in the middle. And so I keep stretching in order to try to make it feel better, but it doesn't want to does it want to loosen? Oh wait, I should plant the seeds. Okay, so first we're gonna put the bean 
here and then we're going to water it uh yes there is space there i think so we'll plant potatoes here and then we'll plant parsnips here um Oh, I should have bought more kale. Instead, there's just going to be one lone kale. <laughs> I guess uh, I can hoe this area and put the hemp seeds here. So that way they're protected by the scarecrow. It won't let me plant when I'm standing over it because it has a pole that comes up. There we go. Let's uh, go refill our watering can and then water everything and then we'll clean up a little bit more of the mess around our farm. This day went by so quickly I didn't even do much, just basic maintenance. But that's okay. That's basically how it goes in my real life one too. Like I said, I'm not playing to try to get anything done as quickly as possible or to try to get a list of things done by 100 days. I am just playing for fun and following my, um, my wants and stuff, whatever I feel like doing that day. Soon we will have uh, some nice things happen as we start to put things in the Junimo, um, Junimo wish list over in the community center. I like how I planted this kale, but I forgot to water it earlier. Come on. Don't get stuck there. You know you want to go here. Look. I planted one. There we go. And then, did I plant something down here? No. I chose to plant it elsewhere. Okay, it's kind of dark, so I don't know what I'm running into. But I guess let's get rid of this wood here. Well... We wait for our energy to run out. I heard a thud. I'm wondering if my toddler woke up or if my dog jumped off the bed. I'm running out of energy. I know. So close. Okay. Now I can... Well... Let me see what we have in here, because maybe there is something I can use to give me a little more energy. So I can do... Um, I could eat a dandelion. This doesn't give me any energy. I... Hmm... I'll take some of those. <clears throat> One and two. And then let's get our axe back out. Oh, is this the area that I couldn't get into because of the giant wood piece down at the bottom? Maybe this is where I can plant my trees. Hang on a second. Sorry, I had to sneeze. I did not want that to go, like in case anybody's listening to headphones. That would have been horrible. Um, yes, right here is the wood thing. Okay. 
And then this is a scythe. We're gonna clean it up. Make it all nice. Okay. Um, an axe. One, two, three. This is stone. Oh, it's 1 a.m. Oops, wrong button. Okay, and then let's get this one. Oh, cool, I got a geode. You found a geode. The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what might be hidden inside? Day eight is when I get my first geode. That's, it's never taken this long for me to get a geode before. Normally it happens pretty quickly. And now let's go to bed. I can put all this stuff away tomorrow when I water my cat. Such a pretty kitty. Okay. Oh, my hair is bright today. So one of the mods that I got for those who haven't watched the other ones is um, a mod to change my hair color every day. So it's really cool to see what comes up. The spirits are very happy today. They'll do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Okay, cool. So do I want to... Um, oh, you know what I should have done? I planted all of those parsnips and I didn't put uh, any of the... I wonder if it'll let me do it today. Okay, let's put all that up. Let's put that up. Let's, well, I don't have enough. Um, I need to chop down more trees. That's okay. Let's pet the cat. And then go get some more water. Oh, it's already clicked. That's right, I watered the cat. Oh, that's right. If you hold down the button with the watering can, it'll keep. Keep going. Um, man, I am sleepy today. I did not sleep well. I woke up every couple of hours worried that I was late for something, even though... Uh, the <clears throat> what I had planned today was not planned for early in the morning. And oops, click on this one. And then down, down one. There we go. Oh. It looked like it was watering the one next to it. Where did this one go? Oh, water. What else should I do? Like, I don't know what to do with that area up there where I put the, um, the chest. Like, maybe that'll be the area where I kind of put stuff together. So that can be the area where I'll put the, um, the furnace. So I can smelt my copper to make copper bars. Okay, one, two. I don't know if anything is right there. There should be something right there. I don't know what it is though. One, two, three. One, two, three. Eventually, we'll get through all of these. And I don't know if I want to get... I'm going to need more parsnips, but I think I'll do that once these parsnips are grown. Um, 
And I'm thinking that kale's not that big of a deal. Like, I don't need to plant more. But who knows? I might decide to buy it when I go because it's available. And I, <clears throat> I always forget. When I'm there, I'm just like, oh, I'm going to buy all this stuff. And then I come back to the farm and I'm like, oh, yeah, I have all of this. I'm already running out of energy. We'll do, uh, we'll finish watering and then we'll go get the, one of the actual dishes. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and sell these. Um, Today's a lucky day. So do I want to spend my time fishing or do I want to go to the mines? I'm not very good at fishing, but um, I'm also not very good in the mines. So I kind of want more copper. So let's grab a couple of these. Let's grab a couple of these. Let's, we're going to sell that. Uh, what else do we need? We need 20 copper ore. So yeah, let's go. Because that's something we're going to want to do. <clears throat> That's really interesting because that way you can't get anything back that you put in there, which is something that I'm used to doing because they'll in the um, DS, there's one little slot that you could put stuff in there. And so you can get the last item that you put in back. Stretching. This is so pretty. Okay, so there's a farm here. The letter that I got uh, in one of the previous episodes where they said that they couldn't talk with us, that's because they're back here. And there's also a train station back there. This is a giant tree. That is so cool. I don't think I ever noticed that before. Oops. I didn't mean to hit that. Are you here, Linus? Nope. So Linus is one of my favorite characters. He's just so sweet and adorable. And all he wants to do is live life with as little. This is a great gift. Thank you. Have you come to ridicule me? No, Linus. I have not. I'm just minding my own business. Okay. I'm sorry. I don't, I can't believe people ridicule you. Well, I can believe it because people are horrible. What is this? Do I need a tool? I don't know what that is. I can't click on it. Do I need this one? No. That's interesting. I don't know what that is. Oh, cool. There's a little quick cart. I like that. Okay. Uh, let's put you in there. And you. I'll keep the scythe. Okay. And then I'm going to quickly uh, organize all this. And then I'm going to drink one of you so I can go fast. And then I'm going to eat one of you so I get more luck as well as more energy. Oh, I should. Uh, I'll wait and eat the other one after, after it's done. 
Okay, I guess let's go get these monsters first. Okay, and then... Oh, cool. I know you're going to come after me as soon as I get close. Oops, I meant to hit this button. Yes. And then let's get you two. Okay, I like walked right into them. So, I like to play games. I'm not good at games. <clears throat> okay, before I go in there, I'm going to get these copper because I need them. I really don't like killing these ones because they never come after me, but I know it's a requirement for the, uh, the list, the lists in the, what do you call it? The guild. All right, we already found the ladder. I'm going to real quick see what's in these because sometimes they have cave carrots there's a geode every time i say it i think of uh, sheldon cooper saying geode when he's like really out of it geode it cracks me up oh there's already another one Okay, so I only have four copper, but I need more than that. I need 15 to make the furnace, because it's 20 total. And then I need um, five for each. Ooh. Yes, leather boots. Okay. <clears throat> you received a leather boots. <laughs> you received a leather boots. That's cute. Okay. One defense and one immunity. You can't even see it because my skirt is so long. Alright, let me get a drink. Let me pause. It's already 6 p.m. Oh my goodness. I feel like this game is a good way uh, for people to learn kind of what it's like for people with ADHD because you'll be playing and then sometimes <clears throat> you'll look up and notice the time and be like, wow, I can't believe I got there already. Where did all the time go? Okay, I still have both of my things on. Oh no. Why are you looking the wrong way? Oh, is it because I'm like clicking the wrong way? Oh my goodness. It was me. It was me all along. Okay. I am sorry, little, little computer me. Ah. This side. This side now. This side. Oh, I hate those things. And they get worse as like the further. No, why? You're just. <clears throat> All I want are these coppers. And I'm now gonna need a food. Yes. Okay, does coffee actually give me, it does give me energy and it's, it's fading. So it's perfect time for coffee anyway. Nice. Oh, 
I was gonna try to get that copper, but never mind. I only have six. Oh, this game really doesn't want to give me copper this playthrough. Copper or geodes. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to try to get this. I'm going to ignore you because you'll kind of leave me alone. Is there any more copper? I don't see any. I'm already on level 13. 14, 9.40 p.m. Oops. Soon we will beat this one. And then the difficult one will be the Skull Cavern. There was a mod to make it so you could have elevators in there, but I chose not to get it because I like the uh, added difficulty. Plus, it's already possible to cheat by just making a bunch of stairs. So, one of the, for those who don't know, there's another cavern, or another, yeah, cavern uh, called Skull Cavern, and they, um, it doesn't have the elevator system like this one does. Oh no. Do I have anything to give me more energy? Can I get this one? I can. Oops. I'm going to go this way, not hit the tab button. to pick this up. Oh goodness. That one was like, I'm gonna get you. <gasps> it was right there all along. Sweet. We opened up another door. What all do we need? Oops. All right. I want to collect all of you. And then reorganize. And then take this to go back to here where I'm used to coming. And then run home and go to bed. So this will be the second day. And then we'll play one more day and then I have to go and see if, um, I have two things I need to do today in real life. So I gotta go get those done. Let's put everything up. And collect. Oh, I haven't got any quartz yet? Cool. Well, I do have quite a few things to bring to... Um, the museum, Gunther. Yes. <clears throat> Ooh, one watering can proficiency, one hoe proficiency. I can make stone fences. I can make a mayonnaise machine, but I don't even have a coop yet. And then I can make a sprinkler. I don't know if I'm going to do the sprinkler. What all did I sell just for? Okay. Alright, and then let's see what our luck is like today. Day 10. Oh, I love this gray color. I kind of... I don't match the TV. I was going to say. It's a rerun. Um, the spirits are very happy today. I will shower everyone with good fortune. What should I do today? 
yesterday we did the mines um i don't know if i want to do that again oops i kind i kind of want to go fishing So should we go fishing over by the um at the lake or let's go at the let's go to the beach. And then we can say hi to the one farmer girl down there. I forget her name. I'm just really not good with names. I'll do that a lot. And now that the characters all look different. I will kind of get them all confused that way too. But that's okay. Because it's just a video game. In real life, I forget everybody's names. I'll even forget my own name. So. Oh, cool. I still don't know if I want to get more because this is taking quite a bit of time since I need to upgrade everything. There aren't normally this many, like if you play the unmodded vanilla version, there are not this many uh, things that you can plant right away, but I got some additional ones, including the one to grow marijuana because I really like marijuana. I live in a state where it's legal, so I can promote different areas here. Which, by the way, yesterday I went to the store to get some edibles, and um, I live in Alaska, and it's freezing outside. And when I went in the store, somebody else came in at the same time, and the employee asked if we were coming in together and I said no because we weren't and the, um, she asked the person if they had their ID uh, to go into the main part of the store and the person was like no I'm just here to warm up and the employee said um, do you want some hand warmers and that just warmed my heart like Nature's Relief is my favorite store locally because they do a lot of different things. It's a calming, like it's a very calm place inside the store and the employees are always really nice. They, um, I can just walk in and say, I want something that will help keep me calm in class, but won't, uh, I'm going to keep a couple of these. Also keep some of these. Um, but I'll say like, I want something that will keep me calm, like keep me from getting anxious in class, but won't make me distracted. And they'll be like, oh, here's this, like, this is perfect. Um, or I'll be like, I just want CBD gummies or something like that. And they'll be like, oh, we have these different kinds. Um, but they also give a discount for people with BIA cards. And that is really amazing because not a lot of places do that. And then they, uh, oh, Piers is closed today. I need a catfish for a taco I'm making. I forget where catfish is grown. <clears throat> but it was really nice to go in there and to see them all. Uh... Did you watch the game last night? No. Or do you even have a TV set? Well, I have a TV set, but I don't watch games. I used to. I used to watch hockey, but... What did you say? It's 11.50 a.m. already? My goodness. You look like you've had too much. There you go. <laughs> you were like shaking really bad. Um, but it was really nice to go into the store. And when another person went in 
to not buy anything, but just to use the place to be warm. They not only reacted in a manner that is uh, respectful of the person, but they reacted with kindness and it just, it reminded me why they're my favorite store. Ooh, I'm hungry. I am getting kind of hungry too. Maybe I'll get a snack soon. Same. By the way, you're adorable. I love your pink hair. I've done pink before, but it's not my favorite color. Purple is my go-to color. All right, let's see if there's any, ooh, there are any forageables. Some of these things will need to go to the community center. Oh, you're so cute. You just let me walk through you. Just sit there, okay. We're getting all the stuff. Ooh, let's try this hack. Let's go sit down on this bench. Oops. Can't I can't sit on this bench? Okay. That's sad. That's okay though. We'll just go fishing. And I'm going to eat that seaweed in a little bit when I run out of energy. There's actually a meme of somebody doing it on a uh, TikTok where they show like the people walking up and watching the farmer go fishing and then they randomly stop and eat seaweed. And occasionally raw fish, but that wasn't inside the TikTok. Oh no, I thought you were gonna go up. Oh no, I'm losing my progress. Ah, uh, okay, no, 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 stay with me, stay with me, come on. Oh my goodness. This wasn't a hard fish either. Okay, stay, no, 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 no. Okay, we got this. Yes, we did it. An anchovy, yay. What else can we get? Yay. Okay. See, that's how easy it was supposed to be to get an anchovy, but I messed myself up and paid the price. Although I got it in the end. So that's cool. Oh, I finally watched Encanto last night and that is the most adorable movie with the most amazing music. I, at one point, uh, my toddler was asking me to do something and I was just like no <laughs> I'm really into this movie she wanted to watch uh, Freddy Fazbear so because she knows I watch it and because she's seen things for it um, on the TV she's been trying to talk me into letting her watch it so I let her watch like the cutesy stuff that fans make um, that's not as scary. Oh, am I in your way? Oops. Oops. 
Some fish come and go with seasons. Others only come out at night or in the rain. I didn't mean to be in your spot. I wish I could just fish like you and just sit there with that and then fish eventually come into the... Although I would get bored. I'm not going to lie. Oh no. Oh no, I lost it. I just realized that um my phone turned off and that's where my chat is in case anybody comments while I'm playing. choices there. Mm -hmm. Hi! I'm just trying to go fishing. I'm not actually very good at this game. Oh, Maybe this is an anchovy. I just lost a fish. Oh, it's a herring. Cool. And as you can see, I'm playing with the diversity mod. Uh, so I'm really bad with names. I have ADHD, so I'm pretty forgetful. But here's the fish. Willie, that's his name, who gives you um, the fishing rod. And as you can see, he looks more diverse. Is the sound okay? Um, can you hear me over the music? Oh no. Oh no. That's okay. I tried. Oh wait, I'm feeling exhausted. I need to go home. So I'm playing the extended and I have Ghibli characters in here to replace the normal woodland characters. So here you can see one of the Ghibli, Ghibli creations. Oh, it's a cutscene. Linus is one of my favorite characters, by the way. And then George is one of my other favorite characters because he's just a grumpy old man who doesn't care about being grumpy and people just let him be that way. Grr, sounds like those raccoons are back again. Filthy varmints. Ah, uh, you turned up at the right moment, miss. Could you do an old man a favor? Could you go around the corner and scare off those raccoons for me? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks. Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. Okay. Oh, Linus. It was me. I'm sorry. I find a lot of hot, fresh food in these cans. Stuff that will go to waste if I don't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? Yes, it's disgusting. No, it's a shame for food to go to waste. Yes, it's illegal. That's George's private property. No, but you should get a job and stop leeching off others. I'm going to go with this one because I know a lot of people who are hungry. And thanks, Kunan. Oh, so I um, found out that on the computer, if you put an item as your name, every time they say your name, you get the item. So I decided to try that this playthrough. Thanks, Kunan. I know you weren't. <clears throat> I knew you were an open-minded person. I feel good about what I'm doing. I'm not harming anyone. That is true. 
Also, if they're just throwing hot food away, then, you know, also I will collect stuff from the trash cans. You can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's can anymore. You can tell him you scared off the raccoons for good. The extended version comes with a dog in here that you can interact with. Wait. He's so scared. I know what you were doing, Linus. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican Town to go hungry. But he's not doing it because he's hungry. He's doing it to create less waste. Here, I have a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in my spicy marinara. Honestly, if everybody in this town would just buy one of those things that turns food into compost, that would be amazing. And then he would probably be happy just foraging outside. Go on, take it. Some of his favorite foods are the things that you forage. Oops. I forgot that I was coming from the beach because I got all caught up in that scene. That's okay though. Gus is a nice person. He's a sweetheart who just tries to take care of everybody. Um, okay, I was gonna say, let's go check up here, but I forgot I'm almost out of energy. Um, we're gonna sell a bunch of stuff. I think I already have a daffodil and in silver. Do I have a, I don't know if I have those. I'm just gonna sell the soda. And then I'm gonna sell this one because I already have one. They said my name a lot in the beginning of this. If you get the extended version, uh, there's a different cutscene at the beginning, introduction. The screen is a little big, you can't see your inventory. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'll see if I can fix that the next time. Um, pretty soon I will be ending this um, playthrough. This episode, I mean. So, because I have to go do a couple things in real life. Um, but I will work on making it so that the screen is true to size. So that way you can see everything. Thank you for letting me know. Uh, and then it looks like I need to make another, I don't have enough wood though. So the next time I come back, I'll make another chest to put all my stuff in. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Whenever I move my hands off my keyboard and then I set them back, I sometimes put them in the wrong place. And then here you can see uh, the cat's ears are purple because I got one of the mods to make the cat Gigi from Kiki's delivery service. Um. I'm going to say that this has been a pretty good playthrough and thank you so much for joining me and letting me know that the screen is uh, a little big. I will fix it next time and I'll probably be back tomorrow, but I might play again later tonight when my toddler falls asleep because today I just want to sit and relax and um, I'm really not good at following a schedule. I have ADHD, so I just kind of want to play whenever, whenever I want to play. And then whenever I play, I will stream. All right. So thank you so much. I will talk to y'all later.